Here we see the user interface for TreeForm, a drag and drop syntax tree editor. To build a new tree, users drag a tree structure from the object browser onto the content pane. New nodes can be added as children of a node by dragging the node down or morph object onto an existing node, or as parents by dragging the node up object onto an existing node. When adding to a node which already has a child, you select the position of the subtree by highlighting the green node and clicking. Every node's text can be edited, like in a word processor. Building a tree and editing the nodes is a quick process. When changing the shape of a tree, subtrees can be flipped into a desired position. This makes the tree very easy to reshape and fix. Commonly used linguistic structures can be added to a tree and they behave as linguists would expect them to. Adding a triangle structure allows a linguist to represent unknown structure. Adding an adjunct copies the text of a child and drops a null to the side, as a linguist would expect. Adjuncts include adjectives and adverbs. Any node, feature, or association can be deleted by button or context menu. Trees can be made more complex by adding case, such as nominative for he and accusative for him. Features can be associated with their arguments. Lines representing movement can be added to a tree. And the shapes can be changed as needed. Theta roles control the arguments of a verb and may be increased in number by adding features to a feature set. Theta roles relate subjects, objects, and indirect objects to their verbs. Features can be associated with their arguments. Linked highlighting establishes the relationship between features and associations. Font effects can be added using toolbar options. Or fixed with undo redo commands. This concludes our demo of tree form.